Welcome to today's presentation. Now in today's presentation, we're going to look at KCC Mathematics Paper 1, the year 2016. And we're going to look at question number 1. Question number 1 is about order of operations, that is board mass. So the question reads, without using a calculator, evaluate. Then the numerator, negative 2 into brackets, 5 plus 3, close the bracket, minus 9, divide by 3 plus 5, all over negative 3 times negative 5 plus negative 2 times 4. So we are going to do the numerator and denominator separately. So begin with the numerator. Now because we have mixed operations, then remember we'll have to apply board mass. Mixed operations in the sense that we have multiplication between negative 2 and the brackets. We have additions, we have brackets, and we have subtraction. So those are the operations. So in case where we have mixed operations, then we have to follow the order. But as where B stands for brackets, then of division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction. So right to the numerator, I want us to deal with each operation one at a time in every line. So in this first line, we have to identify that we have brackets, so we're going to work out the brackets first. So we have negative 2. Then between negative 2 and brackets, we need to recall that we have multiplication. And then dealing with the brackets, we have 5 plus 3, that is 8. And then every other thing remains the way they are. Negative 9 divided by 3 plus 5. And then, once you're done with the brackets, we move to the next operation. So there's no off. Then division, there is, so we move to division. For division, we are going to divide. So let's look at it here. We're going to divide negative 9 by 3. So in the next step, that is what we do. Negative 2 times 8. And then negative 9 divided by 3, that is negative then finally we add 5. Once we are done with the division, let's check if multiplication is there. Yes, we have multiplication, so we multiply next. Negative 2 by 8, negative 16, and then we have minus 3 plus 5. And for the next step, I want us to take note that negative 16 and negative 3 should give us negative 19. That is, if you have negative factored out, you'll have 16 plus 3 within the brackets, and that is equivalent to negative 19. So at this particular point, we are simply adding. Or you can also argue that if you have a debt of 16 shillings and then you add another debt of 3 shillings then that should give you a total debt of 19 shillings so that will be negative 19 just like we had seen and then add to 5 and this finally should be so remember you can rearrange this this is the same as saying 5 minus 19 and this is negative 14 so that is for the numerator next we look at the denominator on the denominator we also have mixed operations so we're going to apply board mass again but here we have multiplication we have got addition subtraction and multiplication so we are still going to follow board mass, there's no bracket, there's no off, there's no division, but the first one we have is multiplication. So 
in the first step here we are going to multiply so check where there is multiplication between negative 3 and negative 5 and also between negative 2 and 4 we are going to multiply negative 3 by negative 5 that is 15 and then we have plus again we multiply negative 2 by 4 that is negative 8 so positive followed by a negative that should give us a negative so we have 15 minus 8 and that is finally 7 here we have worked out the denominators remember at this particular point we are done with multiplication and then finally we subtracted so at this particular point we can now have the numerator so that implies that the numerator, which is negative 14 divided by 7, should give us negative 2. And that is it for this question number 1, KCSC Paper 1, Mathematics 2016. Thank you for watching. Just hope to see you in the next question.